Hey folks, coming at you with another mid-workout video. Um, wanted to just reiterate the importance of having a helmet while you are riding your street strider, but also a couple things that I've noticed, just important safety features to keep in mind. Uh, today, I was out and uh, first of all, before you ride too, make sure that your tires are the right pressure cannot stress that enough. Those of you who are used to bikes, things like that, you know that your piece of equipment does not operate at its optimum level unless your tires are at their level that they're supposed to be. Second of all, I don't know how well all of the street riders work, but mine, <laughs> we're gonna show you here because I almost wiped out today. Um, so there's this pin that's at least in the seven eye. I assume all of them have it. Looks like this, let's see if I can do this. Okay, this right here, this pin, okay? This is for if you're going to um, uh, close down your street strider or um, tip it down, you generally, this is the release here, and then you would pull this pin out and your top part right here will fold down, right? Well, there's a little bolt right here that if you are not tightening that up properly, it can almost mess you up every time. All right, this is the second time this has happened to me where this has been just ever so loose. And because of that, I almost wiped out two times. This particular time, again, I'm about 30 weeks pregnant, would not have been very good. Um, but what essentially happened was, is my entire part here tried to fold down on me as I was pulling back on it. Thankfully, I did not get hurt. I don't even think I drew blood this time, which is great. The first time I didn't, it scared the crap out of me. Um, what you just wanna make sure that you do is tighten that bolt ever so slightly. It's not gonna tighten up a whole lot, but you need to tighten it as much as you can, get it back into position, and then push that down so that it is uh, kind of almost like perpendicular with the bracket there. Um, so just things to be aware of as I as I come to them. Um, also, I don't know if, again, what versions you guys are using. There is another section here. This is for those that, um, it's in the fold down assembly as well. This thing comes down and then this bolt here, it, this essentially comes off so that uh, you can kind of fold it down and then that sort of thing. Street Shredder has videos on that if you need any further explanation. I don't take mine down like that unless it's being moved, which has only happened twice. Um, oh, maybe three times because I had moved up to my stairs and then back down. Anyway, you always want to make sure that that is like in line with um, that pedal as well because you don't want it like tripping you up or like getting stuck in the frame at all. Um, I'm just trying to see too any other things that like safety wise, hey, make sure you're doing this. Um, I have not gotten mine serviced yet by an actual bicycle shop. That is on the to-do list as well before the season is up, just so that everything is lubricated properly. Street Strider, you know, stresses the importance of that. Um, I also bought two, just a shameless plug. I bought some of the light um, features. You can see um, it has like three different features or something, but the front one and the back one. Um, I'm sure you could buy the same one for both things or whatever but I also um mine I bought the luggage rack as well um I really like it and I have two saddlebags I just have one installed right now but these are really nice too these are from like the official street strider ones um sorry I don't know where I have my video is but you can see inside it's got like plastic I have a heavy duty bike lock that sort of thing so anyway just things to keep in mind uh safety first for sure friends be safe and uh hope you're striding well